What's she been telling you? Peter, please don't. Oh, take a ticket and sit down. I don't think you're anything special, mate. She'll give it to anyone. She's like a 7 Eleven. A doctor? A cab driver? She thinks I don't notice. I think you should calm down. Yeah, I don't think you should piss off. You've been told twice now. I'm afraid I can't do that. George, please. George. Did you say George? <laughs> I've seen photos of you. You're the one that disappeared. Do you follow her here? You think you can take her back now? What's she been telling you? She didn't know I was here. I didn't know she was coming in. Yeah? Well, you're wasting your time. She doesn't even talk about you anymore. Yeah, I'm sure you're sure to that. I'm glad she's going to see this. Be lucky this isn't tomorrow. Yeah? What happens then? Monsters come out. <laughs> oh, have I been naughty again? I'm looking for Mr. Gasmith and his dog. You're not here for me? Are they here? Uh, no, I think they're down the old people's home. He likes to take the dogs down there. Old people love animals, don't they? <laughs> they like to stroke them. And Wellard's such a gentle dog. <laughs> well, there's been a complaint that the dog bit someone. Wellard? Can't be possible, he wouldn't hurt anyone. Yeah, Mr Ian Bill? Bill. He said Wellard bit him. Well, that's the allegation. Now, if you'd said Bill had bitten Wellard, I might have believed you. Well, he's very insistent in his complaint. Yeah, well, that's him, the local plonker he is. I couldn't comment. Now, these situations can sometimes be solved with an apology and a few well-chosen words. If you can tell Mr Smith we called. I will. How long will it take you? I can do it in a day. 300 cash, yeah? Yeah, or 150 and free tricks for a week. Who with? Me. I'll take the money. As I watched, I saw Lieutenant Rogers approach the first or second prisoner, pick him up, and punch him through the sandbag to the head, as a result of which the uh, man fell to the floor. I then saw Lieutenant Rogers again lift the man so that he was in a standing position when he kicked him to the body. As Lieutenant Rogers was doing this, members of the unit were doing the same. I could not believe what I was seeing was actually taking place. What do you want? A drink. You'd be lucky. Yeah? Well look, you get them and bring them out here. We have a really nice time. It's you and me. They're stolen, aren't they? Sod off. Let's go inside. Well, nick me if you're going to. You're not coming anywhere near Flory. I I'm not going to nick you. You're only saying that so you can get to see her. I still won't nick him, all right? Ever? No. Now piss off and don't come back. <laughs> Yeah, she got you there, didn't she? Eh? Got you, Mr. Pookie Pig. <laughs> I just want to try for a proper relationship with you and Flory. And, and, and of course, Ray. Not, not, not quite so much Ray, but... I'm sorry, Dad. He's the one that sat on Daddy! Let him in. Just for five minutes. Five minutes? Five minutes. 